He apparently went to this inn, although he will uh, will not be able to find him there. So we arrive in Baldur's Gate at night. What do you want? I find that the city looks better at night, in fact. Uh, certainly I shall collapse from exhaustion before I fall on the A few words field. of introduction on the city. Uh, Baldur's Gate is an important merchant city of the Sword Coast. It's named after the seafaring hero Balduron, who discovered the far western continent of Anchorome, not unlike Christopher Columbus in our world. Balduron returned with great wealth, which was used to build a wall around what became a wealthy port city. It was also used to build a large gate somewhere around here, which is called the Black uh, Dragon Gate. So this become known as uh, Baldur's Gate. I'm not sure why it's called Baldur's Gate and not Baldurans Gate, since, you know, the guy's name is Baldurans, but I guess that's a short name for him. Uh, Baldur's Gate features several inns, guilds, shops, and places of interest, but uh, I'll provide more detail about them as we actually visit them. Out with it. Oh, you're a handsome bunch, ain't ya? And all the people you're here have some interesting lair, things to say. You? Well, not all of them. Hello. Nice to make the acquaintance of such a cultured personage. It upsets me to no end how the Seven Sons trading costs are lost to bandits over the past few weeks. Yeah, that seems to preoccupy a lot of people here. Uh-huh. Anyway, we are in the eastern district of the city. And here there is the Elf Song Tavern and Sorcerer Sundries, which is the best shop in the game. Yes. Uh, we'll begin by going up. If you wish. At Lucky Ello's discount store. Let's just pay him a brief visit. Uh, my prices are the best south of. Hi, folks. Welcome to Lucky Ello. Where the prices are so low, there has gotta be something wrong. Nobody sells it lower than me because nobody buys buys it cheaper. If you can find a price lower than mine this side of this side of Kalimshan, the item will probably kill you. What can I get for you? Okay, let's take a look. So he sells what seem like potions. Uh, most of, well, all of his scrolls are cursed, and they sell for one GP. As the name implies, this potion appears to neutralize any poison currently affecting the imbiber. The cleansing is instant and blah blah blah, but the color seems strange somehow. Actually, all these all these potions are um, cursed. This oddly murky oil would appear to increase the movement rate and combat capabilities of the imbibers. This oddly murky potion appears to restore 9 hit points to the user, so if you take the time to read the descriptions, you can see that there is something wrong. The only potion that is not cursed here is this one. The Potion of Perception. So the moral of the story is, yeah, yeah. if it's too good to be true, then it probably is. We can, however, steal everything of interest. Nicholas, no. Whoops. Huh? Hmm. It is done. The guards were summoned, so we were forced out of there. And we will, we will not enter every house here, similarly to. Uh, uh, what we did in Baragos because there are just too many of them and most just contain mundane uh, items and not much of interest. We'll just go to the most interesting places in the city. Could we have a moment of your time? What is it? First, let me introduce the two of us. I'm Merrick and this is my companion, Lothander. I thought it would be nice for you to know our names, because if you don't take our advice, you'll be seeing more of us too. I know that you've been talk taking an active interest in destroying the Iron Throne, don't try to deny it. My companion and I are in the employ of the aforementioned throne. We thought it would be polite to give you one last warning. Stop interfering with our employer's business. You can decide to disregard this warning, but if you do, it will be the last decision you ever make. See you later. Make all the threats you want. We aren't the one with one foot in the grave. It's anybody, it's anybody stupid enough to get in our way who will pay the piper. 
as I thought. Uh, it's useless to try to talk to them again, they just disappear. So we were warned not to meddle in the affairs of the Iron Throne anymore, but... I don't think we'll uh, simple. pay much heed to that. Welcome to my humble establishment. Here is a shop that sells... Oh, Electric Plus One. Hmm, shall I buy it? Do I need it? Well, Kagan could use it. Yes. Why not? If you Your wish. business has been poor, what with the iron shortage and all. There we go. That's better than a medium shield. What? <laughs> Most interestingly, here you can steal everything and normally the guards should not be called. And there are tons of containers. This is a ring of infravision. Yep. Uh -huh. What do you want? Potion of mind focusing. A magical mace. Uh, we won't pick up that. And we already need to put stuff here. What's this? Oh, Nestor's dagger. Yes, out with it. Potion of absorption, not bad. Potion of invulnerability. Why do they store that in a keg? I don't know. Great peril yields great beauty. If All right, nice doing business with you. And that will be it for now. And uh, we will exit again to Baldur's Gate East. So as you can see, the city is divided in uh, nine parts. And there are tons and tons of side quests in Baldur's Gate. When I said we were getting back on track with the main quest well yes we are but uh, in Baldur's Gate there are tons of side quests as well and tons of good items and XP to be made huh? yeah, yeah. so we'd be we would be fools to miss on all of that just to save time first we will visit this shop Approval for what we've just done. Oh, shut up, Karin. Hmm. Uh huh. It is done. Be ye friend or be ye dead. Let's be your one warning. Walk ye slowly back out with your hands where I can see them. You twitch an eye and you're a fine red mist. Mist instead of a thick sludge you are now. Sanctuary ain't open to just any pick stealing knicker. She doesn't like Zekol yeah, because thought. of his uh, low charisma. Life is wherever fate But she might me. like Koron better. I'll speak when I wills it. I've crossed this realm prodding. time and again, and I am thoroughly convinced that many a fight could have been avoided if the combatant simply had a good night's sleep beforehand. Sanctuary be not so much for hiding as it as it is as it is for resting Rufus bones. So, can we get a room here? Okay. So, we will rest. And it is now 15 in the afternoon. We will also buy from her a sling plus one. Which will go to the highest dexterity sling user. Which would be yes. Viconia. Oh, she already has one. Okay, everybody has a sling plus one except for um, Edwin. All right. So this goes to Edwin. Olsa. 